Established in November of 1975, Rockville's Cultural Arts Commission works to advise the mayor and council on how to develop Rockville as a cultural center. The city of Rockville needs the arts. Uh, they're not an idle uh, toy to have, but rather it's, it's good for us to have art in the city. Well, I think that, you know, we're seeing an increase in the involvement in the arts in Rockville in general. I think there's more pieces of art going up, um, and I think we can really look forward to some major pieces of art being added um, at different gateways into Rockville that will really add um, to the city. Oh, we have so many artistic programs going on right now. Uh, visual arts, dance, uh, music, there's all kinds of things. We have certain subcommittees on the commission that uh, do all sorts of pro public programs. And I think that it's going to really be a great year ahead of us. To keep Rockville thriving in the arts, the commission draws upon the talents and diverse interests of its 11 members. We have actors, painters, photographers, an art teacher, an art collector, um, and as someone says, just an enthusiastic audience member that likes to attend all the city-sponsored programs. The Commission is also involved in the city's Art in Public Places program. There are 52 permanent works of art around the city available for public viewing at any time of the year. I'm so proud to be able to get involved in the selection of the artwork, like uh, City Hall, um, Senior Center, and Police Station. And every time I saw it, I feel, oh, I'm part of that in the process. Residents and visitors of Rockville have many opportunities to get into the cultural arts in the city. Go online to rockvillemd.gov slash arts for the latest happenings. Let's try to think about the how the citizen, the typical citizen, is in contacts the city. What contact do they make with the city? Very few make direct contact with the police, let's say. But many people uh, have involvement in the arts, whether they're a spectator, whether they go around the street and they see art in public places. Visual, literary, and performing arts, it, it's daily in our lives. You hear music, it just brings a smile to you. It's important to all of us to have a sense of beauty and joy in the world. I think the arts, whether the people realize it or not, uh, they're really influenced by the arts in Rockville. For more on Rockville's boards and commissions and how to get involved, visit rockvillemd.gov slash boards commissions.